Hi, I'm Sarah Wood, Senior Technical Representative with Nikon Professional Services. Today I'm going to show you how to enable wireless radio control on your SB5000. So what you'll need is the strobe, the WRR10 transceiver, the WRA10 adapter, and a Nikon D850, D5, or D500. Let's get started. On your SB5000, turn the flash on into remote. Press menu, navigate to the wireless menu, highlight channel. Choose the channel that you're going to be working in today. Push OK to select. Navigate down to link mode. Enter choose pin. Navigate to pin and dial in the four digit code that you are going to be using. This is unique to you and your strobes that are working within this system. Tap OK and once you have that set, go ahead and hit menu to exit. You'll notice the flash will be in remote mode and the sync mode or the pairing mode will be set to pin. The setup for your SB5000 is complete. Now on your camera, attach the WRR10 to the 10-pin terminal and set the channel to the same channel that you just chose in your SB5000. Once you've done that, let's go into the camera menu. Enter the photo shooting menu, navigate to flash control, set wireless flash options to radio AWL. Go ahead and press OK. Navigate out of the photo shooting menu and down into the setup menu. Here you're going to choose wireless remote options and set link mode to pin. Enter the pin options and this allows you to enter your four digit unique code that you just set in your SB5000. So go ahead and enter the same pin and press OK. Now once you've done that, you'll see the green light appears on your WRR10 and stays on and there's a green light next to link mode on your SB5000. So now when you fire the camera, the two are synced. Hopefully that was helpful and you're able to go out and have some fun. For more information about the SP5000 and wireless radio control, visit NikonUSA.com. On the SP5000 page, there is a downloadable PDF called the Fast Track to Wireless Lighting.